And today we are celebrating Easter today. Yes, we are. If you remember, Jesus died on the cross for our sins. And then three days later, early in the morning, a group of women went to the tomb. They were worried about moving the heavy stone that was in front. Because inside was Jesus' body and they wanted to put spices on it. Before we go any further in our story, Sky, do you think you could do something for me? Yeah, sure. Could you crack one of those eggs in this bowl? One? Yep. Yeah, okay. One. Let me just open it. Did you expect that? Was there anything inside of that egg? No. Well, that's weird. Yeah. That's really weird, huh? Try to crack another egg. Okay. Did you expect that? Yeah. So there was an egg inside of that shell, but this one was Empty? Well, that's peculiar. Should we try it again? Yeah. Okay. Huh? There was nothing inside of there. <gasps> Just like we were so surprised that this egg was empty inside, the women were so surprised that the tomb was empty. They thought that they would find Jesus' body wrapped in cloths. But it was empty. And an angel of the Lord appeared and he told them that Jesus was not dead anymore, that he had risen. So the women, they ran and told the other disciples what they had seen and what they had heard and two of the disciples, they ran quickly to the tomb. And when they looked inside, they found that it was empty. They were surprised, but we're not. We know the whole story. Jesus is alive. All right, boys and girls, here's Bible Challenge. We want you to do a resurrection scavenger hunt with us. So, Skye, the first thing we're gonna find is a rock. Okay. Can you guys go find a rock too? All right, I found one. You did great. Boys and girls, I hope you found one too. This rock reminds us of the tomb and the stone that was rolled away to show that Jesus was not inside anymore. Now, can you go find some spices? Spices? Yeah, the women went to the tomb to put spices on Jesus' body. They were gonna put spices on top of the burial cloth. So let's go find some spices. Okay. I got the spice. You sure did. Now these spices are a little different from what the ladies would have used. They probably would have used myrrh, but these definitely work for our scavenger hunt. Great job. Next thing, I want you to find white cloth. Remember, Jesus' body was wrapped in a linen cloth. Go. Okay. Okay, I found it. <laughs> yes, you did. Okay, next thing you're gonna find is three of something. Go find three of any one thing. Have fun. All right, I found it. Okay, what did you pick three of? Three coasters. Great choice, three coasters. Do you know why I had you get three of no. something? No. Because Jesus was in the tomb for three days. Last thing, the last thing on our scavenger hunt will be something empty. Go find something empty.
Oh, I found this puppy in. You did. We're at church filming, so Scott found an empty communion cup. Great job. I hope you guys have a lot of fun on your resurrection scavenger hunt. Well, that's all from us. Bye. Bye. Ninja Ninja Jerkins. Ninja Ninja Jerkins. All right, you ready? <laughs> All right. Oh no. You can pick that up. All right, so I'm gonna say Ew. a resurrection scavenger hunt with us. Jump in the water and the pop, pop, okay. grab. Watch my hair do it. I'm gonna move the friends. Hey, are you listening to me? Yeah. Okay, all right, let's try that part again. That's not going to work for me. <laughs> Thank you, Von Trapp family. All right, I found it. <laughs> You got the hiccups? Okay. That was great. I think so too. We're gonna go with that. <laughs> <laughs>